Welcome to service this fourth weekend of the Easter season. We also celebrate Good Shepherd Sunday this weekend, which is a very special festival for us here at Good Shepherd. We normally have a congregational meeting this weekend as well, which will not be happening this weekend because we're not able to gather in person. We will be in touch, so if you are not receiving your emails or seeing updates on Facebook or receiving the newsletter in the mail, please give us a call here at the church and let us know. We'll make sure that you're on that information distribution list. So when our congregational meeting is able to be scheduled, or if we need to have it through different means, we'll be able to let you know right away. There's lots of other important updates about the changes and shifts in our schedule that are in all those publications and social media spots. So please make sure to get connected to us goodshepherdlancaster.org backslash a different Lent. We'll keep you updated on the web. So will Good Shepherd Lancaster on Facebook and also our mailings that will come to the house as well as weekly emails. We try to keep connected no matter where we're worshiping, right? Also, please remember how incredibly important it is to stay safe in this time. Because of that need for safety, we have voted as a council and a pastoral leadership staff to continue virtual or online electronically facilitated worship at least through Memorial Day. We'll make sure that you get updates after that, but until then, please know that we'll be gathering in this way and that the physical building will remain closed except for a few essential office tasks that will be happening. So we'll see you in person, but definitely not until after Memorial Day. We do deeply appreciate the fact that so many of you have been sending your gifts, tithes, and offerings. We're doing a lot of incredibly important work here, not just in building community with each other, but also building community with those outside our doors who are desperately in need of their siblings to show up and help them right now. There are other ways you can do that besides sending in tithes and offerings to the church to help support things like the World Hunger Fund and the Lancaster Food Hub. We also have boxes that are in the small vestibule area behind the doors that are right off the parking lot here at the church. Those doors are always open to get into that protected front area. So you can come and leave hand-sewn masks, gifts and cards, or individually wrapped snacks, things like granola bars or nutrition or energy bars. Why? Because we're doing a special thing to try and support our frontline workers in medical care facilities in Lancaster County. Several of our members work in facilities like this, or there's facilities like Luther Care that we have close relationships with and where members are seeking medical care or even living. Those masks are essential and life protecting, and they just can't be bought everywhere. So if you are a sewer, please consider using any one of the wonderful templates available online and helping hand sew some masks that can be dropped off here at the church between now and May 15th. We also are making sure that those cards and even colored pictures from children are going to the places where people's spirits might be especially down right now. Places like the testing center next door, places like the nursing homes that are under lockdown and not able to receive visitors, or hospitals and clinics where medical and first care, first responders are offering care. They are accepting mail and they are excited about receiving pictures and encouraging cards and notes that are posted for staff to see. So if you are willing and of an artistic bent, um, or if you're just a wonderful card writer, please consider dropping those off. Um, handmade, just little notes on pieces of paper or beautiful gift cards, whatever you have in the house. Um, if you could drop them off between now and May 15th, that'd be wonderful. And whatever snacks we receive will go with them. Because of safety precautions, those first responders and medical care providers are not able to leave the hospitals, clinics, or nursing homes and go grab lunch or a snack. So what's with them or what's presented to them there at those facilities is sometimes all they have to get through a very long shift. 
So it's really a special little gift and pick me up if we can provide not just notes, but those little snacks to help them out. So again, we do have electronic offering and we do have uh, mail where we can receive your checks and things that are sent in since the building is not open. But please continue to be faithful, loving and giving because your church and your community do need you right now. And the way that you've been showing up as a community is truly beautiful. So please continue. Thanks for helping, loving, and being Christ in the world.